Amazon Glacier is a low-cost storage service that provides secure and durable storage for data archiving and backup. Glacier is designed with the same durability and reliability as Amazon Simple Storage Service, or S3. However, Glacier is optimized for storing data that is infrequently accessed and for which retrieval times of several hours are suitable. In doing so, Glacier is able to reduce costs significantly, which is very important for data archives and backup. With Glacier, customers can reliably store large or small amounts of data for as little as one cent per gigabyte per month. Data is stored in Glacier as archives. An archive can represent a single file, or you may choose to combine several files to be uploaded as a single archive. Archives are similar to objects in S3, but will often be a collection of objects bundled together, similar to a zip or tar file. Archives in Glacier are organized into vaults. Vaults are collections of archives that allow you to set access and notification policies. Vaults also allow you to keep track of the archives that you upload to Glacier. Once a day, each vault has an inventory generated for it, which lists the archives contained within and information such as the total size of all the archives and the number of archives in the vault. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get started using Glacier. I will show the step-by-step -step process of setting up Glacier and configuring it for use. In the AWS Management Console, click on Services and select Glacier. Select the region you would like to use. Click Create Vault. Go ahead and give your vault a name. Click Continue to Notifications. Notifications are sent through Amazon Simple Notification Service, or SNS. You can create a new SNS topic, or you can use an existing SNS topic. You can also choose to disable notifications. These notification settings can be changed at any time through the Management Console. Click Create Vault. Your vault has been created. The console now shows a list of all your existing vaults. We only have one vault, which is the one we just created. Select your vault, and in the lower panel, you can see the details of your vault, such as the ARN and the inventory summary. This inventory contains the list of all the archives within a vault. You will be able to see the size and number of archives contained in your vault at the time of the last inventory. As vault inventories only run once a day, you may have to wait up to 24 hours or so for your vault inventory to be updated. Because we just created this vault, the inventory summary is currently empty. Retrieving data from Glacier requires the initiation of a retrieval job. These retrieval jobs complete in approximately four hours. Any notification policies that you have created will allow you or your application to be notified when a retrieval completes and your data is ready for download. Your notification policies can be edited at any time via the console by clicking on the Notifications tab. Congratulations, your Amazon Glacier Vault has been set up and you can now upload and retrieve data using the service SDKs and APIs. For more details about Amazon Glacier, go to aws.amazon.com glacier.